I hope I didn't get... I got surprise attacked. Okay. By the way, welcome back to some more um, of this. Trails in the Sky. Didn't play this last week. But here we are again. I guess now I need to leave in that battle because I just did my introduction to it. Maybe I'll just like start on that introduction, then that'll work, right? Um, here I am talking about editing a video that I won't even be editing for, oh, probably not until next week, really. Like maybe on Sunday, but... Okay, is this still... Yeah, it must be over here. Now, I have somewhat learned my lesson about picking up boxes that are under trees. They tend to be swarming with monsters. That's been my experience. And I am like genuinely low on healing items now. Well, I say that. I still have lots of those. Maybe I'm not that low on healing items. But I feel like I'm low on healing items. So I should be careful about taking damage. And also, I should remember I have healing magic. Ha! You got nothing on me. Mostly because you cannot reach me. Oh, well, okay. Admittedly, you got me that time. Estelle is just slow, okay? But I guess Joshua is limited to time magic. It makes sense that he would be fast. Speaking of, I have not gotten a whole lot of time seven, have I? Uh... Um... Verdant Bridge to the west still... Oh! Okay, that has got to be it. It looks... it doesn't look like anything I've seen up until this point. But, uh, let's see if there are any boxes. Oh! Well, there's a bug there. And cats. Oh boy, are there cats alright. Nope, nothing under this tree. I can rotate the camera. I should not forget so easily. Hmm, those bugs are a little bit more dangerous in this area, it seems. Okay, we're gonna fight you, but... Let's save first. Also, uh... EXTERMINATE! Yep, we got special boss music, but there is only one of them. How bad can it be? Right? Right? It's weak against fire, actually. Too bad I don't have that equipped. Might have been a... Might have been a good call on that one. 500 HP. 13? Ooh, boy. Uh... <laughs> Okay, that's a water move. Um, well, it did hurt. But you know what? I think I can deal with that level of damage. At least for a while. Come on. Now, let's just see how much damage I, I can boost myself. Hopefully a lot. Um, how much HP do you have, Joshua? Mm. 
I want to see how much damage this deals. Oh. Well, you survived. That's the important part. <laughs> oh yeah, that did so much more damage. That was definitely the right call. Um, you, I want you to heal Joshua, and then you can use magic as well, probably. Because my gut feeling is that... You're not going to hit that hard with physical attacks. <laughs> Only, you can't use... Actually, no. I'm not going to use magic with you, simply because I want to conserve your magic for healing. Also, you actually... Estelle actually hits pretty hard, so... So she has that going for her. Hey. Yeah, that's not that big a deal. Um, let's use morale again. Because I need to start attacking now. Dual Strike! Uh, we're okay, barely. We got this. That wasn't nearly so bad as the- uh-oh. I wasn't expecting it to explode. Um, well, that's not that bad, right? I got some time, Seraph. That's nice. And a dirty carrot. Exterminate monster! Okay, um... Do I have anything that I can heal Estelle with? Wait, can you use... Nope. Okay. Um. Hmm. I don't think I have anything that will recover her from being fainted. Maybe I can rest at the farm? Maybe. I wasn't expecting it to explode! Wait, no, the farm's this- you know what, let's just go to town. Let's just- let's just head for town. I can definitely rest at the inn in town. Or something sort of equivalent. I- I can go to the sewer, you know, that's- that's what we do in this town. We rest at- in the sewer. Uh, this is too far? No, there. It's because I'm not rotating my camera. I cannot see where I'm going. And fixed. Okay. That was quite the adventure. Now, it should be a new day. Let's see what new things are going on in town? Right, let's turn in... Wait. Hmm. Let's save, then turn in... Um... And then, if it doesn't... Like, the problem is, if I turn it in, then it might progress the plot, and then everyone will say different things. Hmm. Uh, actually, not a whole lot. Okay... Okay, let's just do this now. Thanks for finding my rock earlier. You really helped me out a ton. That said, I can't believe my mom is trying to sell folk crafts in a city that has ships that can fly. I'm just amazed at how brazen she is when it comes to business. 
Mayor Claus just came by here. He greeted me with such a big voice. Why was he here? The garden at the mayor's house is so well kept. I heard that the mayor even does it all himself. Sounds like the mayor has a lot of free times on his hands. Hmm. Mayor Claus was weaving around the clock tower earlier. Do mayors ha have to do those kinds of jobs? That's his hobby. There are even rumors that he really enjoys gardening, too. Hmm. Maybe. I suppose that it's convenient to have a mayor who's accessible to, to the townspeople. I do want to buy stuff here, but I need to wait until I get paid. I should also probably visit the item shop, but again, get paid. Uh... Yep. Gotcha. You're still so young and inexperienced, there's no shame in asking those around you for help. Especially you, Joshua. You're the type to keep all your feelings pinned up inside, right? That's been a source of concern for me. I'm sorry to have caused you any undue worry. I'm not worried about Estelle being unable to share her feelings with the world, though. <laughs> hmm. You really, to be, you really seem to be a magnet for that sort of compliment, Estelle. Hey there! So you, I've heard the news that you've started working as bracers. How's everything coming along? We're surviving so far. And we've managed to deal with the monster problem at the Herzl Farm. I see. It seems you have what it takes after all to become adequate fill-ins for Cassius in his absence. But Estelle, don't be too much of a handful for Joshua. Why indeed, Estelle? Why indeed? Hey there, Estelle. How have you been? Have you been busy lately? I've been kind of sad. You haven't been by to buy junk food lately. Now that you mention it, she has been disappearing pretty often on the way home from training. Hey, there's nothing wrong with that. Eating cookies and snacks is the right of any girl my age. <laughs> Stop begging when you've got a day off. Yes, buy the shoes! Look at all the shoes over here, but buy the good shoes! <laughs> it looks like my son is too busy with running the store to worry about other things. Men reach adulthood by status. Or, no, by having a family and rearing children, not by staying... Okay, um... Hmm. Uh, hmm. No comments. Uh, no, no, I'm not touching that one. Ten years ago, the Imperial Army broke through our borders in great numbers and trampled the entire king. I realized why I thought Fate was a girl before is because he's called fucking Fate. Um, like the in my head, to my mind, that is is not a masculine name. Uh, but we were able to drive out through a, a damn near miraculous lightning quick military operation. A counter blitzkrieg, you might say. Without the plan, Roland would probably be part of the Emperor's territory today. I was assigned to the unit in Roland and fought in the war, but my leg was injured by a piece of flying shrapnel. Interesting. Recently, my husband's been doing well with his work. I wish my father would just recognize him as a suitable successor. In the timber industry, woodsmen don't just grow trees to be used. Um... Actually, they kind of do... 
<laughs> anyway, woodsmen watch over the forests, live with the forests, and give thanks to for their bounteous blessings. When a person can do all these things, then they can be called a real woodsman. My daughter's husband is still a half-man in that respect. When my daddy's not around, I do my best to help out mommy. I can help her with cooking and cleaning and laundry. Do you think I'm a big help? I just received word from the mine where my husband works. It seems like they discovered something incredible in a new... Okay, is that load or iode? I genuinely do not know. I wonder what it is that they found. I need to see... Wait, wait. No, it could still be either one. The L's and the capital I's, lowercase L and capital I looks too similar in this text, in this uh, font. Hello! I hear the airliners are equipped with huge machines called orbital engines or something. They s they're said to use an orbital structure as well. It seems that some bigwig professor was the one who developed them. <laughs> now that's something to talk about. Modify. Can I install a new slot? It costs... Oh, actually I can. But I kind of want to do a new slot for Joshua. It seems more... useful. Uh, is what it seems. So... Let's do that. We just did. We, we have done it. Opening this slot for Estelle would be nice as well, though. Also, uh, 30, 30, 30, 30. Okay. Okay! I have one of each of the- I don't have that. Cannot make it either. Don't have either of these. Can't make either of them. I could make one of these. Reduces EP cost. Increases max EP. Increases hit. Um... Hmm... I kind of don't want to use my time. So I think I'll wait on these. I think I'll not make them. I would make this if I had more wind, though. But I don't. Well, let's equip Joshua. We can do defense or attack at cost of defense. Uh, or dexterity. Okay, so wait a second. Okay. Okay. Uh, oh, wait. I see how it is. That's not quite... Hmm. Doesn't work quite how I thought it did. Uh... Okay. Yeah, I see how it is. I was hoping this would tell me um, the type of magic it gives you. Wait. Or does it? It does. It's, it, it's, it's right here. It, it does. But it also looks like I need... Hmm. Okay, it looks like I need at least times two for Earth. Uh, no, no, stone hammer, right there. Oh, no, I've lost my, I've lost my spot. Right there, stone hammer times one. This is like defensive magic or something. And there's healing magic down there. I, I get it. 
I see what you're throwing down. Uh, yes. So, basically, earth or fire, it doesn't really matter. And either one will increase my... Okay, well, I gave Estelle the earth element thing. So, I may regret this, but let's go with fire. Might have been helpful in the last battle. That's much as certain. Uh, yeah. Let's head over here. Still not back here. Their dialogue may change regularly, but it seems that the, um, it seems their po the NPC position does not so much. Although I say that, it looks like the maid is where the housewife formerly was. It seems like the farm's vegetables are finally going to be shipped. By any measure, the weather certainly has not been bad this year. I wonder if something happened. Uh, you could say that. Hello! I heard from Lydda that the vegetables from the farm have not yet arrived. I wonder what's going on. The vegetables from there have such a delicious, fresh flavor. Well, they are from quite nearby, so they must be very fresh indeed. Okay, so I know the mayor is in here. I heard something wonderful came out of a new... I still don't know. I owed at the Malga Mine. I put in a request to the Bracer Guild to transport it here, but... Oh, sounds like a job. Could this be task number two? Maybe. It sounds like a hard job though, so maybe not. Have you two ever met some of the other bracers that have stayed here in this very hotel? We often have bracers registered at other branches dispatched here, after all. Neat. Uh... And so, anyone new? Oh! Looks like the... Looks like the student isn't here anymore, but you're new. Though we came here on a pilgrimage, Roland is a wonderful locale. I think I like this place. I'm impressed. This is much nicer a hotel than I had anticipated. The manager is extremely courteous, and the place is relaxed and immaculate. This is another kind of elegance quite different from the luxurious hotels of the royal city. Go in here... Oh, hey, he's not here. Is he up here? I guess some of the NPCs do move around a bit more. Uh, why is your EP not full? Did it... Did it go up when I equipped it, this thing? Nope, that's not it. How strange. By the way, um... 52. Okay. I see how it is. Hello! Homegrown girls are fine, but those chicks coming from the royal city in Bose have that extra layer of polished beauty. Speaking of the royal city, Queen Alicia's granddaughter, Princess Claudia, lives there. Rumor has it she's quite the looker. I wonder if it's true. You are the worst, Alan. But I love talking to you. Oh, hey, hello. What? Hmm. I wonder what he's waiting for. Uh, let's see. There was a lady around here somewhere. You? Oh, it's just Claire. According to my sources, it looks like there... W uh, you could say that. Hmm. Oh, well. 
Maybe I'll try heading for Grantsville. Then again, my idiot son hasn't been any help. Just when I think he's starting to help, he disappears somewhere! Oh, what a troublesome little kitten. Could she be taking a nap somewhere? I haven't- I can't say I've seen the cat anywhere, but I haven't really been looking for her either. Estelle, Joshua, how's your own work coming along? Come and take a break here every once in a while, okay? Ten years ago, the Imperial Army broke through the borders and surrounded Roland. In an effort to convince us to surrender, they have bombarded the clock tower! I, I apologize for making you recall those painful memories. No, it's alright. Really. I wonder, like, it still doesn't have a mother. Did she lose her mother in the during the war? It would have been before Joshua came along, but maybe not not much before. Miss Mirano, um I I don't think we're gonna have time to be looking for a new human resources. Hmm. You don't say. Ha. Huh. You have that foreigner named Sherizard at the Roland branch, right? Not only is she attractive, but she's one of my best customers, which I'm thankful for, of course. But when she it comes to liquor, she's unbelievable. And when I say unbelievable, I mean unbelievable. She is normally such beauty, friendly, and friendly young woman. I guess I guess Shura is a mean drunk. <laughs> okay, well, uh, I guess without further ado, let's report.